Hey everyone, I am Anush Dixit and you are watching Connect and Arush English. Please subscribe, like and share my channel so I will be motivated for creating technical videos like this. So let's get started. This is our part 22 of our full stack of development series and my exams are going on so I was not able to check that part 22 has not any uh, audio sound so I am recreating that part so sorry for that so let's go to our computer screen and let's see what we have done so i have just created a basic document and this is just that very basic and run that here we have that document but now we want that if there is a div and we have div1 and after this we have div and div2 and here we have div div3 here div spelling is wrong uh, so let's save this and go here and we have that but after we have done this all we can do this we can write the same code with a shortcut trick i am showing you that if we write and this is just a VS code, so don't be serious in that. So div into 3. And like that, we will get some div. Now we want a div space. And then go to your end and press control space and press enter. Here you can do 1, 2 and 3. This is very easy for us. It's also giving the same output because that is the same code that we have generated from VS Code. Let me show you that again with, with this screen cast me. Here if I write do, let me show you again here. If I write do into 3 then this arrow and we have come here now we can write these curly braces and do space go here and control space press enter now go here and 1 2 3 just like this and we have that output but now I am going to show you a thing here how this extra space is coming in it this extra space this extra space that you are showing this and this but this is not document space so how it is coming so for that for removing data space we have css and in css we are writing that is this shift plus eight operator shift plus eight is a star operator you need that, that we call universal selector in css it means every item in your html document will for, will must be follow this thing must we follow the code that here is written and this is the basic code that that you have to write any professional developer firstly write this code then he writes any other code just like this and now if we go here you will see this our extra space is removed 
in if you haven't seen that extra space you can put that put the video 10 to 20 seconds back you will see that thing it is just with one letter space one letter space from here and one letter space from here and that space was too much because that's of one line and one line so it's it's affecting our document so that's why i removed that space with help of this code and you have to write this code in every in your every project here you can proceed with your own code here you can proceed with your own code I suppose you want to select all the diff and change the background color to red and save this we can go here now you will see the background color is changes to red of all the diffs so that's it guys this is in the video i hope you all like this video thank you guys thanks for watching the video